Ivan Imhoff. I joined uh, six months ago as Vice President of Digital. And our role is to really improve the ecosystem and environment for our digital acquisitions. A lot of companies that I've worked with, because a channel exists, they feel compelled that they have to use that channel. We have to be on Instagram. We have to be using Twitter. And it's very fascinating to see how businesses little by little re realize, I don't have to be everywhere. So those are some of the challenges that I think people are still trying to get accustomed to in terms of this sort of digital revolution, where you still have a lot of me too mentality. My competitor does that, so I have to do it as well. Um, other businesses are doing it. They're everywhere on social media, so I have to be in social media. I have to be pro doing programmatic. And um, that's the biggest challenge, understanding that you don't have to be everywhere. You have to be in the right places. You don't have to be spending money on everything. Just because your competitor spends a lot of money on Instagram doesn't mean that it's profitable. And running a business is about profitability above all. So I think those are the challenges that uh, we're facing a lot. What is the ecosystem that we're using? The typical situations are that, number one, companies will not spend enough time fundamentally understanding modern um, sort of distribution uh, channels and methodologies online. Um, they will generally read blog posts and articles and uh, try to apply it. Novel businesses or new businesses to the digital world will believe what they hear on the internet. And yet, what is on the internet is 90% false. And we know lots of politicians that constantly claim how there is false information online. And to a certain degree, it's very true. Two, we don't take the time to understand that everything has a lot of interconnected dependencies, that there is no silver bullet, and generally, there are no best practices. And the one most common question that I get asked is, Ivan, what are the best practices? Best practices don't exist. If anybody tells you that, that is the first signal that there is a charlatan. The digital world is still very innovative and cowboy and fast. Those that succeed are the people that are perseverant, not lucky. Luck is created through hard work and analysis, not just pure, I did a goofy cat video and all of a sudden they went viral, right? Okay, maybe the grumpy cat channel managed to do that and they turned it into a multi-billion dollar business, but they got lucky because they had the goofiest looking cat, but it doesn't work for everybody. So let's not be naive. For every su successful person, there are tens of millions that have failed. So those are my sort of key advice. Don't put in the money. Put in the elbow grease, like we say. Get your hands dirty. Don't follow everything that people are telling you. Do it yourself. Do it your freaking self and understand what those dynamics are. You'll be able to spend the money in a much more efficient fashion and people won't bluff you when they say, hey, I'll charge you $100,000 for something that'll cost you $5,000. That's my advice.